All right, guys. So family guy, most offensive joke compilation. I click it. This is the very first. I, you know, I click it and press play. And this is the first thing I see. I don't know why they got to put a butt chin on buddy over there. He looks like Uriah <laughs> Faber. Uh, guys, I have no idea what we're getting into. Like, comment, subscribe if you love really offensive stuff. <laughs> If you love offensive stuff. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? If you just love hurting people's feelings, <laughs> let's go. And don't like if you're a snowflake, because this is <laughs> not for snowflakes. Yeah, for sure. All right, men, this is Harry the homosexual. <laughs> Say hi to everyone, Harry. Hi, fellas. I told you <laughs> love being gay. <laughs> Harry's choice of lifestyle is wrong, so we're going to beat him up for it. Now, take these baseball bats and get to it. <gasps> All right, good <laughs> he so said, far. Oh. <laughs> no, 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 don't use the bats like that. No, no, don't use them like that either. All right, look, just put them down and use your fists. No, 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 not like that. She's beautiful. What? Isn't she, sweetheart? She sure is, Joe. It's hard to believe she's already 18. Yo, just just for all my just for all my people out there, man, that does not mean that Quagmire in his mind is thinking that newborn infant is of consensual age. I think that people were telling me that's because Bonnie's been pregnant on this show for like 18 years or something like that. But maybe that's just people trying to cope with the fact they think that's funny. I have no idea. <laughs> hey there, sweetie. How old are you? 16. 18? Year first. <laughs> Mom! Oh. I like where this is going. Giggity, giggity, giggity. Oh, I hired a math tutor and a driver's ed guy. Okay, so do you use my car or do you have like a special one you brought? Um, I'm the math tutor. <laughs> no way! So that means you're the driver's ed instructor. Oh. Well, Come on, Peter. Again. All right, time to learn math from a black guy. Oh. <laughs> Bing bong, thank you for invite. Oh, of course. Please come in. Hey, Brian. I bet he thinks you're what's for dinner. Come on, that's a racist <laughs> stereotype. So, when do we eat dog? Oh. <laughs> I am ready for my. Yo, oh my God, Peter! What the hell? Peter, what are you doing? Oh, surely, Jerome, you don't want to stay in the same house as a ghost who carries a torch around. Ooh, <laughs> fire ghost. Oh, you scared yet? Didn't know this place was haunted, did you? Peter. Gentlemen, I uh. give you the Asian. Ooh. Compact, hairless, and fiercely <laughs> intelligent. The penises, while tiny, are extremely efficient. We're projecting 10 billion <laughs> within five years. Also, there'll be different varieties that will all Is this like God? Do they eat just like regular yeah. food? No, 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 the opposite. <laughs> the opposite. Dude, I'm so dead. Like, what was that? <laughs> I want to, that episode, I feel like I need to see more of what that episode was. Oh my God. If you guys don't know, man, I know y'all don't want to hear his blabber, but we have a Patreon where we do like full length TV shows and stuff because we have another channel, The October is No 2.0. <laughs> and uh, we react to movies and stuff. We really need to get on some full length family guy because I feel like we would just crack up we don't really watch too much comedy over there to be honest which is unfortunate more. because i yeah like i said we've been crying a lot over there at least i have <laughs> i've been I mean, crying a lot over there <laughs> <laughs> may i help you yes 1950s doctor me and my friends are looking for your friends with a negro and a cripple this man is insane take him away <laughs> <laughs> now wait a second, you can't do that to him. A Negro speaking up to a white person? This man is insane! <laughs> <laughs> now look, I don't think- All cripples are insane! Euthanize <clears throat> this man! <clears throat> Something I can help you with? Yeah, you got any brain-dead women in there you let people have sex with for a few bucks? Sure, come on back. <laughs> Your powers are weak, old man! <laughs> Obi-Wan! <laughs> Boy, you got here just in time. <laughs> On your marks, get set, white guys, go! I have high hopes for this. I had a cliff bar before we started. Everybody else! <laughs> <gasps> I thought they were coming after us. <laughs> dude, bad news. You're dead. What? But I'm dead. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Super deaf. You're done. So, what now? I go to heaven? Nope. When a death dies, he gets reincarnated. You're being reincarnated as a Chinese baby right now. Girl? Girl. Oh, that was I saw terrible. That one coming. I knew that one. Come on. <laughs> Do math. Ah, just kidding. 
As you are aware, Asians are known for their great sense of humor and enormous genitalia and respect for non-Asians and for being joking? polite. Now, give me big American food, you fat, ugly, Kojak, bang, bang, American fat souls. Now, did you get a look at the man who assaulted you? I did. Okay, can I get a description? Yeah, he was probably around 5'9", five, 5'10". Five, Which is it, 5'9 or 5'10"? I'd say 5'10". Okay, we'll go 5'9 and a half. <laughs> now, how old was he? Late 30s, maybe 37. Uh, I don't know, anywhere between 35 and 40. Okay, well, let's say 37. How, how about ethnicity? Yeah, he was Asian American. Asian American. We talking <laughs> Korean? We talking Thai? We talking Vietnamese? Maybe Korean. Uh, could have been Japanese, but but I, I think Korean. Okay, Korean. <laughs> now, how about identifying characteristics? Any any marks, piercings? He may have had a tattoo. He may have had a tattoo? Did have a tattoo? Which one was it? I, I don't know. It, it, <laughs> it all happened so fast. You know what? It's fine. I have a preliminary sketch here. Is this the man who assaulted you? <laughs> <laughs> Package for Glenn Quagmire. Oh, uh, excuse me. <laughs> I got a package for you, too. All right. <laughs> nice try, but I built up an immunity. It's <laughs> <laughs> an old boyfriend of mine. What? Oh, sorry, I was out of it. Wait, are we being robbed? Happy <laughs> new life, and we'll have equal rights for all. Except blacks, Asians, Hispanics, Jews, gays, women, Muslims. Um, everybody who's not a white man. And I mean white, white. So no Italians, no Polish. Just people from Ireland, England, and Scotland. But only certain parts of Scotland and Ireland. Just full-blooded whites. No, you know what? Not even whites. Nobody gets any rights. <laughs> <sighs> America. Uh, mailman! <laughs> Me? No, the other black guy in shorts. Yes, you. Here. Well, you, sir, are a racist. And a rude one at that. So, you're not a mailman? Okay, yes, I am a mailman. <laughs> but these are my 1983 Maurice Cheeks shorts. <laughs> Okay, you're good to go. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> I'm a little mad because that would be not okay. <laughs> I know, we'd have issues. I just don't think we'd go that way. <laughs> We're just going to say right here. <laughs> okay, you're good to go. Morse code. <laughs> Oh my god. Who else for Quagmire? <laughs> That's what they literally said on the thing. <laughs> Alright guys, so I don't really know at some point. I mean at some point I should feel bad at laughing at some of that, I'm sure, right? That was a think? tough day for Asians, boy. That was a tough one. Uh, how you feeling? <laughs> <laughs> you feeling good? Uh yeah. <laughs> Ooh. All right, uh, we really need to check out some full-length reactions at the right. end of the day, man. Cause... I need to see some context behind some of those. They're they're funny, but I like. Are there full episodes you know, like that? Or the thing is, is like you don't really know too much about Family Guy, right? Like I feel like I've seen one or two episodes, but I can't really remember. It was like a long time ago. So, guys, I know y'all probably don't believe it seriously, but growing up, man, she watched SpongeBob and stuff like that. I know that she was one of those type of kids. Me, on the other hand, like I did watch a little bit of Family Guy, especially like the first two seasons because my friend had it on DVD. As I got older, like I, you know, because I had a kid young, you know, my first son was born when I was on the younger side. And when I, when I had my kid, I just sort of like cut stuff like that out, you know what I mean, in a sense. So it's really fun to catch back up on that type of stuff. I'm not saying that I haven't seen episodes here and there. I definitely have. But have I went through like the catalog and went through the episodes and watched shit? No, I haven't. And so I really need to get a better scope. But it's like, that 70s show, you know the show, that 70s yeah. show? I went through and watched it, and as a kid, I thought there was a thousand episodes, and then I grow up and I realize there's like, what, four seasons or something <laughs> crazy like that? So it was a really small show, so I don't know how many seasons of Family Guy there are, right. but we definitely need to check some out. But the thing about this show is it's a really good show. It's It actually has a plot line, it follows a story, and they make callbacks, and then things build off each other and stuff like that. So, I mean, there's some good things about Family right. Guy, but... I just felt like it was a more edgier Simpsons. That's what I heard. So, yeah, it was. So, sure. I never... Not as bad as South Park, though. Right. South Park was just off limits for me. But, you, like, I, I mean, you're not... you're familiar with Family Guy. You've like, seen episodes. Yeah, like, I can identify Peter Griffin. You know Meg Griffin? Yeah. Chris Griffin? Yeah. A Quagmire? I know about Joe. Quagmire. Joe, yes. Uh, Cleveland? Bonnie? Yes. Cleveland's the black guy. Yeah. Uh, Bonnie? Bonnie's the, Joe's wife. The pregnant lady, yes. Uh, yeah, so we really need to check out some Family Guy, man. But this was really funny. I hope you guys had a good time. I don't really know what to say about it. I'm trying to make this video a bit longer. You know well, how the heck was, were we watching the most offensive and then the baby wasn't in it? 
You know what I'm saying? I feel like he's he has some good ones to offend Stewie? someone. Yes. Yeah, I love that. He's always offending someone. Let us know because we're checking out Family Guy. We want to check out some of these uh, South Park compilations. And I know, I know that you guys want us to check out full episodes and stuff. To be honest, man, I'm just going to keep it as real as I can with you guys. We do have another channel where we react to movies and stuff. It's like, it's a time suck. It takes like all of our time, basically. It's our main channel. It's what keeps us going and everything. This is a 2.0 channel. Not that this is a second rate channel by any means, but when we react to full length episodes, it takes a long time to edit that stuff to like pass copyright because they'll yeah. block it and shut my channel down if I yeah. post stuff like that. So um, definitely we'll do that. Maybe I'll start doing it on Patreon. You know what I'm saying? And we'll keep reacting to like comedy and stuff like that. But even these specials, I have to edit them in and out. And I still get comments to this day. I try to explain it, but people but oh, well, you edited this one more than the last one. Dude, if I could just react to it and put it on YouTube and not edit it at all. That would be easy peasy. Easy peasy, baby. Yeah. I can get them up so quick. Everyone would be happy. Even Unfortunately, us, if I us. edit the video, if, like, if I'm cutting out of the video to my face laughing, like, I'm only doing as much of that junk as I have to. Like, trust yeah. me. So I'd rather not do any of that. I'm going on a tangent here. Thank you guys so much for hanging out.